Top 10 Things to Do in Mazatlan, Mexico Mazatlan is a coastal city, facing the Pacific Ocean. It's known for its spectacular beachfront boardwalk, historic district and ample resorts. Many Mexican resort towns have one or two of those, but not all three. For this reason, there are many interesting things to do in Mazatlan and it should be high on your list of destinations. 10. Zona Dorada With all the qualities vacationers could want, it's easy to see why Zona Dorada is the place to stay in town. Beginning at the northern end of the Malacan, the Golden Zone has rows of beachfront resorts, exceptional access to white sand beaches, and a brilliant mix of waterfront cuisine and nightlife. Spend your days on Playa Ceballo, wander a few steps back for a golden hour cocktail, before exploring the nearby streets in the balmy evening hours. 9. Aquario Mazatlan. Featuring more than 50 exhibits, the Aquario Mazatlan, Mazatlan Aquarium, is one of the top aquariums in the country. This is a popular rainy day activity and always a hit with families. Visitors can enjoy a close-up experience with a range of marine life such as sea lions, macaws, and seahorses. 8. Isla de la Piedra. To the south of downtown Mazatlan, there is a channel that runs out to the Pacific Ocean. Despite its name, it's connected to the peninsula, however it purveys a remote feel. You'll feel a world away from the action in the heart of Mazatlan, with the cobblestone streets replaced by dark sand, groves of palm trees and rows of palapas. 7. Playa o Las Altas. Literally meaning high waves beach, Playa o Las Altas offers some burly surf. Surfers, boogie boarders, and brave body surfers come from all parts of town to try and catch the perfect wave. For us mere mortals, the entertainment from the beach often proves to be enough. In the early hours, you'll spot fishermen come in on their traditional crafts, taking their wares straight to the local restaurants. 6. Historic District. If you're a fan of Europe's old cities, you'll love everything about Mazatlan's historic district. Otherwise known as Centro Historica, this part of town is painted with cobblestone streets, prismatic colonial buildings, and harbors secrets that date back 500 years. Wake up early to explore the district before it gets too busy. Wander along the quieter streets, enjoying the details of each historic building. 5. El Faro. For a slice of history that comes with the best views in town, hike to the summit of El Faro. Since the early 19th century, the hill, which stands at 515 feet above sea level, has been used to aid navigation. The lighthouse may be a beautiful sight, but the real highlight of the trek is the panoramic views. After climbing up over 350 steps to the summit, you'll have vast vistas of Mazatlan and the peninsula as far as the eye can see. 4. Basilica of the Immaculate Conception. The cathedral has a mix of prominent architectural styles, from neo-Gothic and Baroque to neoclassical. Its wide variety can make it seem like an illusion as you set your eyes upon the opulent yellow frontage which hangs over the zigzagging black and white entrance. 3. Cerritos and Brujas Beach. Days on the beach lazing under the sun, makes for the perfect relaxing vacation. But if you're up for more than just beach bumming, make your way to Cerritos' exciting beach. Here, you can ditch the beach towel and break out the surfboard. 2. Malacan. Many waterfront Mexican cities have a beautiful strand to walk along. Mazatlan's Malacan is the longest of them all, stretching for 13 miles along the deep blue coast. It functions as both a fantastic trail and also a thoroughfare that brings each part of the city together. 1. Plaza Machado. In the center of Mazatlan's historic district, Plaza Machado is the beating heart of the city. The buildings are accented by gilded carvings and secondary colors, with the plaza encased in leafy trees creating a prismatic array of light and shadow. The gorgeous aesthetics are due to a concentrated effort to revitalize the area to its original brilliance. Travelers should set aside ample time to enjoy the culture in this part of town. There are several cafes with street-side patios, perfect for people watching and taking in the atmosphere. Don't be surprised if your experience is complemented by live music and traditional dance.